wonderful morning. Very comfortable in here, um, but I have been told otherwise. <laughs> um, good to see everybody here. It's, a, like I say, a wonderful day. This morning I want to read a verse um, out of Proverbs chapter 8, verse 13. And I'm not going to read the whole verse, I'm going to read up to the colon. It says, Fear the Lord, the fear of the Lord is to hate evil. Now we know as Christians that God has uh, told us to love one another. That we are to love our neighbor as ourselves. Um, love is very, very important. Very important in God's house and God's word and in living uh, a godly life. But have you ever thought that we as Christians should hate something? And here Solomon is telling us to hate evil. Um, God hates evil. I mean, God hates sin. God does not like sin. Because sin separates us from God. So, it's hard to separate at times. It's hard for me to separate at times. Because you see somebody doing evil, somebody sinning. And you have to love that person. You have to love them because we're commanded to love them. But you do not love what they are doing. Um, hate the sin, but love the sinner. Um, Solomon tells us that um, several times here in, in uh, Proverbs about to fear the Lord is to hate sin. Over here in uh, chapter 3, verse 7, um, he says, fear the Lord and depart from evil. And uh, in 14.16, it says, a wise man feareth and departeth from evil. So if we want to be wise, if we want to be like Solomon, if we want to be all-knowing in God's word, we have to fear God, but we have to depart from evil. If, uh, you know, if you have, and I have friends that, that we know are, are sinning, we know that are doing evil, hanging around with them sometimes is the worst thing we can do. Because, and, and it's this way, it's just, it's just life, it's what happens. It's easier for us to turn to that sin than it is for them to quit sinning and, and uh, turn to God. Now, I don't know why. Um, that's something that happens so very, very easily in our lives. It's easy for us to, to, to sin. So, you know, if you're, if you're hung up on TV shows, if you're hung up on music, that uh, all it does is promote sin, promotes, you know, the TV shows on, on regular TV today are, you know, full of sex and violence and, and uh, killing and the language and you know, if if you're hung up on that, <coughs> you're not hating s sin. You're not hating evil. If you're watching it and liking it, you're not hating evil. Um, so we have to <coughs> have to program ourselves to to hate evil, to to love people, but to hate evil. And uh, that's that's tough. That's tough for me to do. So. I pray about it, and I, I tell God a lot that, you know, to, to let me, allow me to love someone, but not to love what they do. And uh, say it, it's easy to say, it's easy to say that, but whenever you're confronted with it, it's tough. And uh, the only way that we can get through it is to have God, is to have him in our lives to uh, be praying daily, to be reading his word, and he'll help us get through it. So uh, think about that this week. To, to love the love the sinner, but hate the sin. If you'll bow with me, please. Lord, we thank you for today, and 
We thank you for the many blessings that you've given us, Lord, and we thank you for uh, for allowing us to uh, to love one another. And we know that it is your command that that we should love one another. And dear Lord, we just pray that we can separate the sin of of people from the sinner, Lord. That uh, we will love them and and hate the sin, Lord, at the same time. Dear Lord, just be with us and guide us and. Be with us whenever, uh, during this time of, uh, of worship music, Lord, that uh, you'll open our hearts to you and then Brian's word, Lord. Brian, bring in your word, Lord, that uh, you will be glorified in, in you only. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. <laughs> 